Hey, what's going on everyone? Hope you're doing all right. My name is Matt, this is Dwyer Creatives, and today is Tuesday. So that means two minute Tuesday. I'm gonna be showing you how to do a countdown timer. We're gonna be using DaVinci Resolve, and you see I do use this for my two minute Tuesdays. You'll wanna go ahead and open up DaVinci Resolve, create a timeline, drop your clips in, then you'll head over to the editing screen. And here you'll wanna to go to Toolbox, Titles, and then Text Plus, and drag this onto your timeline. From here, you'll go up to this text box and select time code. So you'll have your hours, minutes, seconds, and frames. You can change your font, your color, the sizing of it. And if you go over to layout, you can change the position. What I would advise doing is coming down here to anchor and locking it to the left. If your characters are different sizes, they'll move back and forth. So this just ensures that everything does not move when the timer is going. Now, what we want to do also is go ahead and move into Fusion. You just want to make sure your clip is selected. Hit that little wand there, and it'll show. You have hours, seconds, minutes, and frames. We'll unclick hours and frames, and head back over to the editing. So now you just have minutes and seconds. The next thing we will do is create the duration. So you're going to go down here, change clip duration, and I am going to set this for two minutes and one second. Change that. Then we're going to go ahead and create a new compound clip. So count down, down, timer. Create. In here, you see you'll have the option to change the speed of it. So make sure your clip is selected. We're going to reverse it. And there you go you have your countdown timer. From here, you can change the position of it, uh, the size of it, put it wherever you want on the screen. So there you go. You have your countdown timer to create your own two minute Tuesday or however long you need it. If you have any questions or comments, definitely leave them down below and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.